is Local 3 News at 6. Chattanooga's Audubon Acres is hosting Project Healing Waters Fly Fishing for the benefit of disabled veterans. Our Elise Zwick has gone fishing. Eight local veterans are keeping it real as they cast their lines to practice reeling in a big one. We use fly fishing as a, as a tool for emotional and physical rehabilitation for veterans with disabilities. Ross Schweinforth, a Vietnam veteran, is the program lead for Project Healing Waters Fly Fishing in Chattanooga. He started this branch of the program in 2013 and wanted to support his fellow veterans. And my love for fly fishing and I'm a veteran myself and it was just one of those things that I felt like God was working in my heart uh, to cross those over and put those together and here we are. The national organization started in 2007 at the Walter Reed Medical Center in Washington, D.C. A veteran was casting on the front lawn of the center recovering from back surgery. Current regional coordinator for the Tennessee Valley says this work is therapeutic. On the river, there's no better, more peaceful place than to be there. I think that's where the, the, the heart, mind and soul really becomes quiescent. A course was laid out with targets to hit. Each target is worth points. Whoever scores the highest goes to the next round and wins an all expenses paid trip to Montana and the National Fly Fishing Games. Uh, we practice like we play. You know, we, we practice like we're actually fishing. So when we do get out there and we go fishing, you know, we're, we're able to hit the target that we need to to get the fly in front of the fish. Andrew Mann is the winner of the regional casting games and a Marine Corps veteran. He loves being a part of the organization and his dream was to make it to Montana. His dream came true at Audubon Acres. It really saved my life, you know, after being overseas and seeing some of the things that we saw overseas, you know, that can affect someone mentally. And being out here, being with my fellow vets, being out here concentrating on my line, the water, the fish, you know, it takes my mind off of all those negative things in my life. The organization encourages other disabled veterans to be a part of the program. Reporting in Chattanooga, Elise Zwick, Local 3 News. Thank you, Elise. If you're a disabled veteran and want to be a part of this program, visit projecthealingwaters.org.